What's up, y'all? And today on CountryCast, we are going to be talking about a lawsuit which has recently been filed by two of Josh Turner's road crew members and the estate of David Turner. Now, if you remember, David Turner was the sound engineer for Josh Turner for some time who tragically lost his life after a fatal tour bus accident back in September of 2019. Now, before I get to the lawsuit, I'm gonna give a quick recap on that bus accident that took place in 2019. According to a report by California Highway Patrol, Josh Turner, his band, and road crew were actually in two separate buses. The road crew bus that night was en route to their very next venue after playing a show at the Vena Robles Amphitheater. The next stop for the band and crew was supposed to be at the North County Concert Venue when they were just moments away when the crew's tour bus actually veered off of Highway 46 and diving off a 50-foot embankment and ultimately landing in a creek bed. It was noted in the report as well from California Highway Patrol that seven crew members had sustained minor and major injuries and also reported the passing of David Turner, Josh Turner's sound engineer. All right, now that we've had a quick recap on the actual bus accident, I'm gonna go ahead and get into the lawsuit now, which has, again, recently been filed by two of Josh Turner's road crew members and, again, the estate of David Turner. According to a report by the San Luis Obispo Tribune, the lawsuit has been filed against not only Josh Turner's management company, Modern Management, but also All Access Coach Leasing Company, which in that report they detailed that they were the the ones who uh, maintain the maintenance on the bus and actually operated the bus as well. Now also indicated in that report, the driver of the bus that night was a Bradley Dratnell. He is also listed as a defendant in that lawsuit as well. He is an employee for All Access Coach Leasing. Um, again, he was driving the bus that night. The San Luis Obispo Tribune went into detail about what the lawsuit reads as far as what the plaintiffs are asking for. Uh, the report indicates that there's not a specified amount of money that is notated. However, they are asking for money to cover the cost of burials, lost wages, and some other unidentified uh, expenses. And it doesn't stop there. Another complaint that is listed within the lawsuit is that the management company and the bus company should have have known just how dangerous the bus actually was because they are claiming that the bus did not have any seat belts for its passengers. The lawsuit has been filed with the San Luis Obispo Courts, uh, again alleging wrongful death, negligent and defective design of the bus, and negligent hiring. And also according to multiple media reports, California Highway Patrol has actually completed their investigation on this crash, but they have not yet shared the final report. So it does remain uh, unclear at this moment as to why Dratnell uh, left the roadway that night en route to the next venue spot uh, for Josh Turner and band and crew. And here is a look at just some of the photos which were posted to social media by the San Luis Obispo Fire Department that night. Uh, what a tragic scene. And of course, Josh Turner losing a longtime partner and member David Turner, who was his sound engineer for some time. Uh, very tragic night. And of, of course, this is still going on for uh, not only the band and crew members, but the families as well. Uh, we pray that everyone can come to a uh, solution with this and again that was just an absolute uh, tragedy that struck Josh Turner and his camp that night and our prayers are still with you guys and we know just how much of a part that David Turner played in uh, making Josh Turner sound great and really bringing the show to life for him. Guys, that will be it for today's video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. Turn those notifications on for breaking updates on your favorite country artist and all the news coming right out of Music City. Y'all stay country.